got this model from a client of mine. He asked me to fix any issue with it as any. In Blender, you can see it perfectly looks fine. It is shaded smooth and has no artifact. But when I switch to Roblox Studio, you can see the problem. It has invisible faces. You can look inside the model. Now this is powered by the flip normal. If I show you this in Blender, in the overlay tab, enable face orientation. And you can see that whole model is red. Uh, normally, a model should be blue, like this one. So this is this has this model has correct normal, and this model has flip normal. So to fix this issue, all you just have to do is tab into edit edit mode, select all the faces or vertices with A, and then press Control Shift N. In this menu, uncheck inside and this will just flip the normal of the model. Now, re-export re the model as FBX file. Copy the setting that I am showing you. The path mode should be set to copy. This option should be turned on and selector object should be checked. And make sure that you uh, select the object before exporting. Uh, the, your object should be highlighted in light orange color like you see. And then name it and save it. Let's re-import the model in Roblox 2. So you see now, it looks fine now. You can see the difference. This one has flip normal and this, has, this model has correct normal. Now I want to show you what happens if you uh, don't select your object when exporting, when exporting it from that. So you can see I haven't selected any object and uh, I am exporting an FBX file which will not contain any object so you can see selected object is checked and all the settings are applied so I export the FBX and then I try to import it in Roblox Studio you will see what will happen so I select my model and you can see it says your match is no what this is because my FBX file doesn't contain any data ID because I didn't select any model so make sure that you select your model that you want to export before exporting the model okay. now another issue you may you might face in studio might be this one you see it says your mesh has too many triangles limit is 10 half. now this is because I am trying to import this model in studio which has you can see 15,000 triangles but the limit but the limit is 10 half. so make sure that you when, I, when you are modeling your object you stay within the limit you stay under 10,000 to fix this issue, you may use this modifier, decimal modifier. Now you can see down here that uh, 
it, it is reducing the phase count to this number. If I go too far with this modifier, I start losing the phase of my model. So, this modifier is suitable in some cases, but not every time. So, make sure that when you start modeling, you take care of the triangle limit from the very beginning and not in the end like in this situation uh, in this particular situation I can get away with the I can get away with this triangle limb I again apply the test I have to reduce it so now it's 9000 right so now if I will try to re import this model in studio it will work fine let's see and this is the model yep so as you can see it has imported successfully So make sure that you take care of the triangle limit from the very beginning.